told me never trust a man except God. Get yearn, better have your own plan. So I tell you the same. That's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby sister, Rocky Gibraltar. By my side, wife, I ain't to sing and praise it. Yo, it is Justin Coletti of Sonic Scoop. Thank you for joining us for another installment in this hip hop production series we're doing with Paul Willie Green Womack. Tremendous producer, mixer, engineer who's been working in this genre along with others for decades. This time, he's going to be taking us through vocal production in the hip hop context from editing and comping to tuning and sweetening, a whole bunch more. This one is brought to you by Steinberg, makers of Cubase. That is Paul Womack's preferred DAW of choice. He's been using it for a couple of decades now and for good reasons. It's one of the longest running DAWs in the music industry. And in a way, it's one of the youngest DAWs in the music industry because it constantly has new features getting added in, usually hitting Cubase before they hit any other DAWs. Tremendous development team there. So if you're shopping around for a DAW, definitely check those guys out at steinberg.net. Check out the Cubase software. Paul is going to be using almost exclusively stuff that's just built into Cubase stock plugins. He has a couple other more sophisticated add-ons as well, but these concepts are going to apply no matter what DAW you're in. Thanks for joining us. Remember to hit like and subscribe down below. Hit that notifications bell so you don't miss any more videos in this series on hip-hop production. Big thanks to Steinberg Cubase. Big thanks to Paul, Willie Green, Womack, and big thanks to you for being here. Let's get right into it. Paul, Mr. Willie Green, take it away. All right, peace, everybody. It's Willie Green, and we're back. We're here working on this joint called Family that we're putting together with Liquid. We did the vocal session, and now we're going to go ahead and clean up some of the vocals, do some edits and some tuning. Then we'll be ready to mix this thing. So for the verses, I'm mostly good with the verses. You know, timing-wise, Liquid is great great timing, so I don't have to do a lot there. The dubs on that, I'm happy with. I'm happy with how, how they're sounding, how they're fitting against that lead vocal. But I want to look at the hook a little bit. And when we did the vocal session, the first main stack of the hook, I time-aligned. Cubase has the auto-alignment panel here, and that has time-aligning built in. So we're going to use that for alignment. I aligned the first main stack, but we've got a couple dubs in there that are layering certain words. I want to go ahead and tighten those up. We'll start with that. Let's take a listen to the hook as we have it right now. Too far gone, where you came down home. I love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't. You my one true star. Shoot for the moon, your land in the galaxy. Heaven is within and connected by your tapestry. I love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't, you my unborn star. Shoot for the moon in your land in the galaxy. Heaven is within. Look, is you sis or you sus? Is All right, so those aren't far off, but we're going to go ahead and just tighten them up that extra last little bit. So I'm going to start by taking our pieces that we want. We're just going to bounce those, replace the event. So now these are just one region straight through. And we're gonna go to the auto alignment panel here. We're gonna select hook one as our reference, and then hook dub one and two. We're gonna select these as our targets. And we'll go ahead and leave that at 100%, and we'll just align audio. The audio alignment panel is dope for hip hop producers who are working in Cubase. It will ignore spots where there is no target to align to the reference and just take the parts that you want. Some of these softwares, if there's any kind of gap, it throws the whole thing off, but not here. And that's super crucial for us. Let's take a listen to how that came out. Too far gone, where you came down home. I love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't. You my one true star. Shoot for the moon, your land in the galaxy. Heaven is within and connected by your tapestry. I love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't. You my unborn star. Shoot for the moon. Land in the galaxy, heaven is within. Look, is you sis or you sus? Is you all right? So, I like that, that feels good. So, we're gonna take those and we're gonna go ahead and fly them over to our next hook, just like so. And now we're gonna take a listen and see what those feel like. I'm gonna mute these other backgrounds for a second. Love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't. My one true star, shoot for the moon, your land in the galaxy, heaven is within and connected by your tapestry. I love you, everything that you are, everything that you ain't. You my unborn star, shoot for the moon in your 
land in the galaxy. Heaven is within. So those are tight. They flew over just like we expected them to, and so those are good to go. Now, on this other part here, I sang a little background on here. I wanted to something a little bit melodic. We had in both hooks. We don't need me in both. We're just going to put me at the end. So we're going to start out. Let's get ourselves another track version here, and we'll name it Tune because I need that. And now let's jump in and clean me up. So when I'm tuning, I kind of do a lot of singing. I've got a pretty decent rel relative pitch. I don't have perfect pitch, but I've got, I've got a good idea of where things should be. Maybe I don't have that same idea when I'm in the booth singing it, but when I'm sitting down to edit, I've got a good idea. So I'm going to sing to myself and use my ear to figure out exactly where these notes need to be. We got to lock these in. Yep. You're my one true star. Yep. 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 Ma, ma, ma. You're my, ma, 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 ma. You're my one true star. star You're true my star. one my true star. You go up to the C here. You're my one two star, star, two star, two star, two star and then we'll tighten up the end. Star, star. All right, so I'm already sounding a lot better. We're gonna tighten that up a little bit. You're my one two star, As we're doing this, we are gonna go ahead and mute that chord note delay. It's driving me a little crazy. I don't know about y'all. You're my one two star. You're my one-two star. Like that. Heaven is within. Heaven is. Heaven is. Just lock these all in. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. All right, so this needs to be G sharp as well. There. Heaven is within. 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 With, with. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. With, with. Let's flatten these a little bit so we can. With, with, with. Heaven is within. All right, I'd sing with a little too much vibrato. Heaven is within. So we're just gonna flatten these out just a little bit. Heaven is within. We're going to clean out all my mouth noises and all the smacks in there in a minute. So you'll see, I don't necessarily tune in an exactly linear way. Sometimes the note it needs to be, for me, is informed by the notes that come after it. That's another frame of reference. So I might go forward and then come back a couple syllables just to make sure I'm really locking it in. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. All right, not bad. I'm crooning a little bit here. So now we've got that. Let's go ahead and let's just clean up all the smackiness in between these. And we'll actually go back and do that on the dub track that Liquid did as well. What the song does not need is my extra mouth noises. Everything that you ain't. You're my one. You're my one two star. So you see, I'm using the super tool, the combined selection tool with the range and then your regular selector so I can click if I need to and edit something or I can grab the range and let's we'll clean up everything in between and get it out of here. You're my one, two star. We can use a little fade on that. You're my one, two star. You're my one, two star. Clean. Heaven is within. Pretty clean. I got a little, eh, so we're gonna fade that a little bit. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. You're my unborn star. You're my unborn star. Go ahead and get all this out of there. Goodbye. You're my unborn star. Clean. So if these were lead vocals, I might leave that breath in there. But since these are layering on top a lot of other vocals, I am going to remove that breath. We don't need too much stray stuff. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. 
Heaven is within. I'm going to get another track version. We're going to call this time. As you see what I'm about to do next. So I'm going to take these regions and we're going to bounce these events. So now this is just clean what I'm looking for here. But I want to lock these three together. I'm not going to align them exactly to the lead because I want the tails, the kind of legato, at essence, the last bit of star and the end pieces to hold. So I'm not going to time align these to the wraps, but I am going to time align them together so they're nice and tight and doing what they need to do as a unit. We are going to make green hook one our reference and hook two and three as our targets. And boom, it's really that easy. You're my one, two star. It's clean now. That's sounding nice. Let's hear that in context. Love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't, you're my one true star. Shoot for the moon, you land in the galaxy. Heaven is within you connected by your tapestry. I love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't, you my unborn star. Shoot for the moon and you land in the galaxy. Heaven is within. Okay, so that's cool. That's cool. I want a little more sauce on those, though. Like, those are cool, but, you know, we can put a little more flavor on it. If I'm producing somebody else and they've got the ability to, you know, bang out some harmonies, this is where I might ask them to put another note or two or whatever on here. But as that's not my strength, I can ask Cubase to put another note or two on, two on here. So let's see what that's about. So I'm going to select my first of these hooks and we're going to go up to audio and generate harmony voices. So that's fly. So we ironed out a lot of the vibrato. So I'm going to turn this reduced vibrato down to 50 because it's going to just line things up pretty flat. We'll let it give me three voices and yeah, let's open the sample editor. So we click that. And this is now giving me a three-part harmony on top of what I had. You're my one, two star. You land in the galaxy. Heaven is within me, connected by your tapestry. I love you. Every All right, so let's go ahead. It gives us soprano, alto, and tenor. We're just going to swing those out a little bit, filling some of the cracks between our hard panning. And then we'll see. I know it sounds a little robotic right now, but we're gonna work that out. Love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't, you my one true star. Shoot for the moon. Mute the leads on the hook for right now. Love you. Okay, so that's smooth. Now we turn it into something. I want to tighten up the sound of those a little bit. So we're going to go one by one. We'll start with the soprano. Okay, we're just going to select it all. So you see, it's basically just giving us one note. There's nothing super crazy here, but now this is all in very audio. I can finesse these more if I need to. I'm pretty happy with the notes, but I want to play with the formant and make it sound a little less robotic. You're my one, two, star. You're my one, two, star. You're my one to 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 star. It sounds a little digital, but I don't mind that for the rub. These are gonna blend in, and I've got three of me doing the main note already. You're my one to star. Yeah, I fool with that. I like that. So let's go to the alto. Let's add you in. Let's see what it's doing by itself. You're my one two star. Okay, so that's not so bad on the form. You're my one two star. You're my one two star. You're my one two star. All right, somewhere around there. Let's hear that in context now. You're my one two star. You're my one two star. You're my one two star. 
Right, so now you see we've got two different notes on there. But why stop at two if we could have three? Let's see what's going on with you, tenor. You're my one, two star. Heaven is my thing. You're my one, two star. You're my one, two star. Heaven is with them. Okay, let's see how that sounds in context now. You're my one, two star. Let's double check this last chord here. Something in there that I don't want to hit. This bottom note. So I think I like that the best. I'm not in love with this G natural on the turnaround here. So we might just lose that. Right, so maybe we'll just take that out of the tenor. Just move that whole. Because it would naturally go to that G sharp, which we've got covered in the leads. So we don't necessarily need that in the backgrounds. Let's hear the whole hook together now. Love you. Everything that you are, everything that you ain't. You're my one true star. Shoot for the moon. All right, and then I just sent them to a group, so now I can process all that hook together. I can compress it, send it to verb, or whatever I got to do. All right, so that's good for the vocals. I'm happy with that. That sounds clean. The next thing I want to do before it's time to mix, and this is starting to enter into mix territory a little bit, but I want to do some drops. So drops are changes in the beat, alterations that kind of support the arrangement and support the vocal and just give a little different vibe and life and, and movement to it. So there's a couple spots I want to do some drops just in the drums just to add a little bit. So the real important thing when you're doing your drops is to make sure that they really support the song. This is not about, let's just do some razzmatazz so it sounds cool. But remember, we're addressing the song. Every step is about addressing the song. So there's a few lyrics I want to kind of highlight. Uh, so what we're going to do is take some stuff out to make some space to put a spotlight on what's happening vocally right there. So let's go into the first verse. And it doesn't have to be crazy. When we come to this part of the first verse... Every uncle is a black James Bond Smoke Walk like you got soul So she's adding in some kind of flavory stuff Breaks up the it breaks up the pattern of the verse It break, breaks up the rhyme um, And the kind of spotlight moments Every every uncle was a black James Bond Smooth That smooth is like an exclamation point there So I'm gonna highlight that But we're gonna drop the kick there So simple Go in the midi Mute that Goodbye. Check this. Every uncle is a black James Bond. Smoke. Walk like it. Right, so you just leave it open there, and then you come back with that hump. It's adding tension. It's tension and release. So we hold on. Oh, it didn't drop there, that kick on the one. Now we're here, but the vocal takes that spot, so we're just clearing out some space. Every uncle is a black James Bond. Smoke. Walk like you got soul. But don't. Okay, and then on soul, I don't want to do the exact same thing, but we're going to 
change it just a little bit. Right, and then just a slight variation on the kick, just so it comes back in. It's not just, oh, it's just muted again. Now we did a little bit of extra flavor on there. So just that much, and we're going to accentuate the delays on that smooth and soul when we get into the mix, but that's just going to give us a little more room there. Now let's jump up to verse two here at marker number five. I like to do something at the top of verse two because we've come out of the hook, we've added all these elements and there's different sounds, and now we go back to the original arrangement of the beat, and I don't want it to feel like the energy just dropped out. So this is a good place to use that come down in energy, but add a drop to just change direction and add a little life there. Heaven is within. Look, is you sis or you sus? Is you right? Again, I think I'm gonna just take this kick drum out. Let's see how that feels. Heaven is within. Look, is you sis or you sus? Is you right or you just? Cause a righteous soul would never try to take us. All that I am, my nephews are greater than. And don't be like me, shawty be better than. I spent a long time trying to fit in the box. So I like that. And then we're gonna want to do something on the snare later on, just for some variety. So we've got this anticipated syncopated snare rhythm, but we're gonna take it out on 37 and 39 and let it come in every other bar. Cool, I like that. That's grandma's wisdom. So when grand, you know, when grandma speaks, you got to listen, you got to cut out a lot of the noise. So we're going to do that here to let that line really come through. Revelations from Genesis through to Matthew and your nana told me never trust a man except God. Get yearn, better have your own plan. So I tell you the same. That's for So I'm just curious if we take this shaker out here. I'm going to leave the clap in. I don't want to take out all the backbeat. Let's just see what happens when we take the shaker out. Revelations from Genesis through to Matthew and your nana told me never trust a man except God. Get yearn, better have your own plan. So I tell you the same. That's for all right. So we're gonna do that in these same spots. Just kind of accentuate our drop. Clear a little more out. So shaker, goodbye. Revelations from Genesis through to Matthew and your nana told me never trust a man except God. Get yearn, better have your own plan. So I tell you the same. That's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby sister Rocket Gibraltar. Okay, so I like that. And now just at the end of this turnaround of this drop section, we're just really just looking at these four bars. She don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to What if we mute the strum there? She don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to me. Tell you the same, that's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shut out to my. Uh, I don't know about dropping the whole thing out. Let's keep the downbeat. Tell you the same, that's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shut out to my. Maybe the second hit. Tell you the same, that's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another. And this third one. Uh huh, uh huh. Tell you the same, that's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shut out to my baby sister. I like that. A little, little break up in the in the rhythm. Tell you the same, that's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shut out to Do we need the shaker here now? Tell you the same, that's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shut out to my baby sister. Tell you the same, that's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shut out to my baby sister. What's happening here in this part of the loop? Shine, tell her find another Luman. Shut up. So it's just that strum, but we're gonna take that, we're gonna bounce that in place so everything stays. We're gonna move it, we're gonna reverse it. Tell her find another Luma. Shut out to my Ooh, that's cool. That's cool. 
in neon Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby sister, Rocky Gibraltar. I like that. In neon Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my. Okay, and I want to accentuate where the kick and the bass come in. We're going to use the snare for that. In the young Oman, if she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby. So we are going to. Okay, we got to straighten that out. The snare was swung, but in this case, we want. But I don't like those pitches. I want that to be a little more dramatic. So I like when it goes up to that G sharp. You gotta exaggerate that a little more so. That's cool. It's a little loud still, so we're gonna bring this down a little bit. And now let's hear this whole section in context. Just through the math, you and your nana told me never trust a man except God. Get yearn, better have your own plan. So I tell you the same. That's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby sister, Rocket Gibraltar by my side, wife, right in Yeah, I like that. And this shaker might wind up coming up a little bit. A little more definition in the highs. This through the math, you and your nana told me never trust a man except God. Get yearn, better have your own plan. So I tell you the same. That's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby sister, Rocket Gibraltar by my Oh, I kind of want these two back now. Just these two shakes. Tell you the same. That's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby. No, I want three of them back. You, however, my friend, need to go. Tell you the same. That's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby. Right, so that's that last one I added back, number three there, gives just that, just that in and out. Which sets up my snare fill, which sets up the rest of the of the verse. Tell you the same. That's for any young Oman. If she don't match your shine, tell her find another Luman. Shout out to my baby sister, Rocky Gibraltar. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice. I fool with that. And let's just look at the end piece here. So we're out of the hook. Shoot for the moon in your land in the galaxy. Heaven is within. Heaven is within. So we're going to come back with that heaven is within. We're going to take these pieces and we're just going to chop them. And now we'll select grid relative so I can move these on down the line. I'm just going to use it as a sample. It's going to resample it in the outro. Heaven is within. So we'll bring that back there one time. We'll group these together because we're going to want to maybe move those together. But let's take some more of that, of that hook, just to give us a little something spicy on the outro so it's not just a ride out on the beat. Yeah, so let's take end piece from the verse. Same thing, we're back on grid relative. And let's just see. Cause I love you. 
Okay. So I like that timing there. That's different from where it's been, but just a little variation in the outro. Connected by your tapestry. I love you. And then we're going to take the thicker one with the stacks. I'll bring that, I don't know, somewhere over here. That's probably not it. But. It's not wrong there, but I don't know if it's right. All right, so we took that thicker stack and we just flew it to the end in a couple spots to complement where the other one was hitting the thinner ones. Take a listen to that. And that's clean. So there's our edits. We're now ready to go. Everything is kind of in its place time-wise and arrangement-wise. So the next step is just going to be to mix this thing. We're going to take all the pieces and turn it from drums and vocals and different elements and make it into a record, make it into one complete song. So that's up next. Stay tuned. Peace.